They just confirmed eight new cars. Some insane eight new cars. This being in season three, High Ride. They're adding so many new cars that we already knew about because we knew about the Mini Cooper, we knew about the DBS, we knew about, I believe, the Jeep Gladiator, but that was it. That was all we knew. But now they just had to, they just showed us the entire schedule for the year one pass. Can double, triple, quadruple confirming that this update will be four months long, but this update will feature eight year one pass cars on top of the base models. So these are the cards. We begin on the first one in the March drop. Now this is going to be March 13th, where we get the Mini Cooper. This one you will need for the playlist. So it's an important one. We get the Mini Cooper. That's how you play the brand new playlist. If you don't own it, you can buy it, but you, you will have to own it to play it. And if you have the year one pass, you get it for free. But seven days early access because re releasing on March 20th is the Aston Martin DBS. This car right here. This one we, 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 we've seen and it's, 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 it's alright. I hope it has good customization. But then we get the next month, which is this. <laughs> we have the April drop with first and foremost the Jeep Gladiator which we've seen in the trailer seven days early access just like before presumably at the start of the month with the integra which we also saw in a trailer which if you were subscribed which head down there and do that because early access videos out on this update in two days and we'll have all of this confirmed if you you you, you check out those videos etc so the integra we know we're getting we already are aware that we're getting the integra etc etc but it seems that the month after that is a Forsberg month because these are the two cars. The Nissan 3... The, no, no, not even 3, just the Nissan Z. The newer one with Forsberg Racing. And we do have the base model of this car already in the game, but we're getting semi-slick tires. Oh, it's beautiful. The Forsberg version of this car. For the Christopher Forsberg is coming back to this game. This is part of the May drop. So <laughs> it might or it might not. Uh, funny joke, it went over your head. Don't even worry about it. And then the Nissan Ultima. Yes, I, I'm hoping. No, am I? No, maybe I'm not. <laughs> so there's a chance that one of these cars is the base model Ultima. But the base model Ultima looks like this. So, <laughs> you would hopefully understand if I didn't want them to add this. If I went, hey guys, maybe instead of this, add something a bit better. But we are getting this, which looks uh, touring, I assume. Do we have? Yeah, we've got Forsberg cars in the touring spec and it's got slick tires on it, but... That doesn't help because Forsberg's drift cars have slick tires. But we are getting a Nissan Ultimaniac. This car right here. Does Forsberg drift this car? Because I suppose that'll confirm if it is... Oh, looking at it, it appears Forsberg very much... Well, how do I put it? Uh, drifts the Nissan Ultima. <laughs> so it might actually be in drift. Huh. One thing, though, is these cars are not going to be customizable. That's already known, because none of Forsberg's cars are. We're talking no liveries, we're talking no parts customization. The only thing you're probably going to get is a few vanity items that you were able to put on it. These, these cars, as well as these cars, are going to be seven days early access. If you own the year one pass, you can receive these cars before everyone else does. And we now know that the third month, May, is likely going to be a this, a, a Forsberg themed month. We know that the first month, I, 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 well, we just know that it's these two, really. <laughs> we don't have any other information on it. But what we do have is this. The final month, the June month, is featuring the Lotus Emira, a brand new, a, a very new Lotus, 
a very overpriced Lotus, but you'd know about that if you watched the Stick Drift podcast. A podcast for all things car, car culture, racing, racing games and motorsports, where we recently talked about how this Lotus is way too overpriced. W- way too overpriced. So check out the Stick Drift podcast if you want to stay up to date on the regular car world. But what we do have is the Lycan Hypersport, the W Motors, a brand new brand in the Crew Motorfest, W Motors with the Lycan Hypersport. Well, actually, it just says Lycan, so it doesn't, you know, who knows. This thing, if it has customization, same with the Lotus, if they have customization, these are two insanely good, insanely good cars. What a insane reveal to show us all of the upcoming year one pass cars just like that. They must be really confident for what's coming in this update. And then of course in August, we get the the, the, the first month of what will be the first year anniversary after update of the Crew Motorfest. Crazy. And all of this with a couple other bits of promotion that they've done, including a trailer which showed off this thing as well. A what I think people have, have, have unanimously assumed is a is, is, is a custom creation. Because it is just nothing. No one has found this as a real car. So it seems to be another homemade car. Which it does look like that. It looks like the Tempesta to me, the orange thing from the Crew 2. I guess we'll find out what that thing is like, but in this trailer, we did also get a couple of other reveals like the Integra, but what we didn't get is all of this. So I suppose Black Panther is going to be one of these months as well? I doubt Black- Oh! Like in Hypersport! That's a very rich man car. (laughs) That to me sounds like Shmi. And Shmi is the person who's going to be at the very... He's one of the people featured in this update. If it wanted to... Twitter, please. Twitter, work. God damn it. Shmi is also part of this update. He has a bunch of really expensive cars, really expensive licenses. Um... Well, he, he, he owns a Zenvo, right? For the for the love of, he owns the, the man owns a Zenvo, so I assume he is gonna be part of that last month. And Black Panther, he's a bit of a JDM man, I suppose he'll be part of the month with the Integra. Um, and we all know Black Panther loves a good pickup truck and big car, especially something as big as the. Uh, the the cheap gladiator so hey i think he fits right in right there (laughs) terrible same with the lotus now the lotus i would assume is street and the lycan is definitely going to be hypercar It, it it works nowhere else whoa absolutely insanely whoa this update is gearing up to be nuts Except for the fact it's gonna go for four months, but we do get a bunch of quad, like they're adding multi-scrapping, they're adding vehicle garage sorts and whatever, that doesn't really matter, but they're adding wheel mode. This update could be amazing. And I'm really hyped. What do you think about all these cars? What do you think out of these cars? Which one are you the most hyped for? We know that the DB5 is gonna be the playlist reward car, but... Wow. And then we get an Elite bundle on top of that. We get returning motorbus cars. We get the returning Crew 2 cars. This is going to be a stacked update. A very, very stacked update. But it's an update that's four months long. I don't know. Look, it just, look, it just left up. An update that's four months long. I don't like it. I don't like it, but maybe it's good with cars like this. You know, who's to complain? Just a reminder, because I didn't really mention it, these are also going to be seven days early access if you own the year one pass. And then everyone else gets it a week later. Am I looking forward to it or what? 
Thank you to popular members, especially thanks to famous members, and an insane thank you to star members, Grim Pepper and Extreme Speed, and an insane, insane top of the top thank you to icon members, HK and Extreme Speed again. I'll see you boys in the next one in a bit.